I think that's a little bit of a coincidence, and I'd like to credit myself a little bit to tell you the <laughs> truth. I think she can take that credit. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I was, um, I never had dreamed that I would end up at NASA. It wasn't until I was in college that I realized that NASA hired normal people and not just geniuses, and this was somewhere that I could work and if I worked hard. And I started really actively pursuing NASA. I thought that this was a place where I would be uh, really happy as a career um, working on such amazing things. And one of the ways I did that is I got involved in uh, going to conferences. I got involved in professional organizations like Mayas. Um, and at one of those conferences, uh, NASA would go and, and help uh, talk to students about what type of opportunities were out there. And at one of those conferences, I encouraged a certain somebody to come to the conference too and uh, <laughs> take the opportunity to come present and really take advantage. Well, they paid for you to go to like a cool city and have fun if you presented something. And at the time, I was really involved in research. I did a lot of research at the university, so I did a lot of science stuff even while I was in school and so I could present that. So I said, oh, okay, I can present the stuff I've been doing at school. And so I got to go to this cool trip to Phoenix and go hang out with my sister there. And, uh, and at that conference, I presented that research and then got really good in contact with a lot of the people at NASA and got really interested also because she kind of opened my eyes to the cool stuff that NASA was doing. And I had previously worked for General Motors and knew I liked working on something that was a cool end goal. So. Uh, that's how we both kind of ended up at NASA. Well, that's how you ended up at NASA. Yeah. When she got hired by NASA, and I had been interested in NASA for about two years, I thought to myself, if they hired you, they better hire me. <laughs> and so this comes in the little uh, bit of competitiveness of twins. If you can do it, I can do it. And so after she got hired, I made sure that I stayed persistent and I went to lots of different conferences and career fairs and took advantage of applying uh, to a lot of different companies. Uh, but in my top choice was NASA and I'm lucky enough to, to be here now and to get to work with my sister on very cool projects.